will probably forever hold the number one and two spot. But Grandmaster and Dakpo are contenders for that number three and number four. But enough about that. These contenders right here, just like I said, anyone can wear the crown. And Snoop, rocking with Yoshi, we have Sauce going with the cloud. Now, I have not seen Sauce in Vegas, so I'm tempted to just say he's from out of state, but we'll see how he plays here right now against one of Vegas' best. Probably one of the best Yoshis to ever do it. I'll say it. Okay. Nice up B to get out of disadvantage there. Good job getting back onto stage. Doesn't want to burn that limit too early. And he, if he gets him to... Okay, he's just going to let it go. I feel like that's more standard now than ever. No. <laughs> Now, now he tried to hand me a red ball. I was like, no, no, no. Oh! Hold on. I looked away for literally three seconds, and Snoop had stolen the stock from Sauce. And Sauce is going to have to be careful about that because we all know how susceptible Cloud is to being edge guarded. So he has to be very, very careful about how he's getting back to the stage because you know Snoop is gunning for it. Sauce coming in with the cross slash and neutral. Breaking through there, just mixing up Snoop's timing a little bit. He wasn't ready for that. I like the idea of the four. Oh! I like the idea of the up smash there to try to catch Snoop coming down on the ground, but thus far, Snoop has been laying on the percent on Sauce, and he catches his jump from the ledge. He just knows where he's going to be. He has to burn his limit now. He lost limit. He lost limit timed out while he was off stage. That is tragic. Snoop in a really, really good position now. He's running through Sauce's stocks right now. First to an edge guard, and then second to an edge guard as well, but the limit was not in his favor there. Sauce still has an opportunity to bring it back. We all know that comeback factor that Cloud has just in that limit. The double egg, that was clean. Gonna take him up high for some percent here. Tried to catch the landing with the up tilt, but Sauce gonna make it through. Just the air dodge down into the roll. Here's his opportunity to even it up slightly. Oh, he had a chance there, but he was trying too much to mix him up, and he did not recognize that his shield was down. Just let the cross slash go in his shield. And it's kind of sad because Yoshi's shield just never gets any smaller, so you can't really shield poke him. So in some instances, that cross slash may have hit the shield stab, but not here, not against Yoshi. He goes for the forward air. He had to go for it. Egg into forward air is almost always just going to hit. Okay, is he going to jump from ledge again? He does the up B. He's trying to get up aggressively against Snoop, and now his percent has climbed so far. He's going to have to do a lot to make it back here. I'm not seeing it. He lets the cross slash rip. Another aggressive up beef in the ledge to cover himself. It's looking grimmer and grimmer for Sauce here. Snoop now hunting for the kill. That forward tilt, so good to pop him up. And he's just searching for the up smash. Up smash, up air, back air, anything he can do to just kill him. There, the Nair? I think that sent him off far enough where he can't even recover. Yeah, he didn't even have to hit him a second time. That was a very, very strong first game from Snoop. That looked rough for Sauce. Maybe he might have another character he can run to to try to deal with Snoop's Yoshi. As I said, one of the best Yoshis to really ever do it here at Hail to the King. And Sauce has to sort of alter and figure out a game plan to combat him. It looked like he was he was doing a solid job. I know when he was winning neutral, it's just his um, punish game was lacking. He would get one or two hits on Snoop and then struggle to chase him off stage. And how are you really going to edge guard Yoshi? Come on. I'm wondering if Cloud's forward air can just eat through the double jump armor from Yoshi. I wonder if it has a damage threshold. But either way, Sauce is going to have to play a lot more reserved and a lot more careful around Snoop because Snoop is a demon when he, get, when he hits you. Snoop loves his advantage state. You can see where, oh my goodness! Snoop took him for a ride. That was insane. Just one neutral win. The forward tilt into double up airs and the way that he chased Sauce down and confirmed the second up air, the second forward air. He is just relentless when he hits you. Here he goes again, gonna try to catch the landing. Sauce coming in with another aggressive up B, but he, he, held the, he held the up smash way too long. Snoop was able to punish him for that one. And now his second stock is almost gone. He has limit, he, Snoop is only at 20%. He's gonna have to do a lot to come back here. He's already at such a huge deficit for losing his stock so early. And another super aggressive forward air from Snoop. He is not giving him any respect off stage. Hitting him once in neutral, chasing him, catching him on the ground, and continuing that offstage. Snoop is a monster right now. Sauce trying to make his way back into the game here. Impressive down air. 
He's got, oh, he got the neutral win that he needed. And he almost caught Snoop with that up smash. That was very close. Uh-oh, he's, he's got to tech those. This is hard, the egg, double egg. That almost killed and I almost popped off. Aggressive cross slash from the ledge and now he has to try to get back. He air dodged, he's just dead now. That was rough. Snoop eating up all of his stocks. I'm pretty, that was the six stock. He just six stocked him. And um, we were all here for it. I was here for it. You were in the stream for it. Sauce was definitely here for it. He definitely felt every hit that was coming his way. And that's, you know, what can I say? Snoop's Yoshi is one to watch out for, for here, at, here at Hail to the King 3. And I'm really excited for what's about to transpire today because not only are Fo and uh, Dakpo missing, a lot of players that were not even on last season's PR have been coming up considerably in the rankings and their wins have been getting better and better. Like I said, just the other night, Vash took his first win off of Fo with Wii Fit Trainer. It, it was either Wii Fit Trainer or Little Mac or a combination of the two. It was insane. Players like recently Vash, Frog has been coming up getting insane wins. Um, Kaius Red, one personally that I'm watching out for. A lot, oh, So Good Pop as well. So Good Pop, our resident Wii Fit Trainer main, has been making waves. A lot of players in the middle level have been rising considerably. So Ven might have his work cut out for him tonight at Hell to the King 3. It might not be 